everyone. Welcome to Beauty in the Garden. I'm T. In today's video, we are planting up more squash. Now, everyone knows that the squash vine borer has devastated a lot of our plants. We plant them up in these containers right here. Now, I will be adding some amendments to my soil. Now, my soil is in pretty good shape, but I am going to add in some worm castings. So here is the worm castings that I use. Now I did pick this up from a big box store. So you can see if you can go ahead and find this. Now this is the earthworm castings. It is a 1.25, okay, in nitrogen. So this will just be a just enough for the plants as starter plants. So this is a half of wheelbarrow full of soil and I'm gonna add in two cups of worm castings. I'm just going to stir it into the soil. Now I'm going to fill up these trays. So now that we put soil in, we're gonna give it a slight push into each cell to give the plant a firm base. And then we're gonna go in and fill the rest of the tray all the way to the top. This is pre-moistened soil. We don't wanna compact the soil into our seed trays, okay? So right here, you can see that the soil is pre-moistened. So before we get into planting up our squash, I'm gonna talk about some of the varieties that we'll be planting in today's video. The first one here is the summer squash, the board hook zucchini, and as well, we have the yellow crookneck squash here, is two-tone. I will be planting of the Italian striped zucchini. And as well, the cocozel zucchini. The golden zucchini. The white bush scallop squash and last but not least this pretty cool package here squash blend now it comes with the total eclipse the sunbeam lunar eclipse par partial eclipse and as well the moonbeam so it comes with five hybrid squash in here and I think that's pretty cool the different varieties that are in here so in this container right here what we're gonna do is gonna make a hole now, because our squash seeds are pretty big, we're gonna plant them an inch deep. So I have my handy dandy pencil and I will plant it up to the metal part, so one inch deep. I am popping two seeds in per cell. So the first one we're gonna plant up is the blend. I'm gonna just plant up maybe two of them and see what we end up getting. Let's go ahead and do two more trays. Okay. So I'll end up planting up four cells. The next one is I'm going to plant the yellow crookneck, the two-tone. And 
And like I said, we plant it up an inch deep. You see how big the seeds are? They are nice size. So I'm going to tag them. That one was the scallop blend. Here. And then we planted up the yellow crook neck. Two tone. And the next one I'm going to plant up is the Cocozelle. The next one up is the Italian Striped. I'm gonna do actually. I'm gonna do two of them. Italian Striped. Golden zucchini. Golden zucchini. And I changed my mind about planting up the white scallop squash because I'm going to plant up the mixed variety here. Now I have three more that I have here. Another yellow. I'm gonna do another yellow crook neck. This one here. Okay, and now I have one more left and that one I'm going to put in the Ford Hook Zucchini. That was the Ford Hook. Okay, so now we have planted up all our seeds, and now the next step is to water them in. So I'm going to collapse the holes. And now I'm going to water them in. I'm not going to water them in with any type of fish emulsion or any type of water soluble until they start putting on their true leaves. So because our soil is already pre-moistened, we just need to wet the soil down just a little bit to settle the seeds. Okay, you guys, we're at the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoy the content. Please don't forget to give the video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell so you can be notified when I do upload a video. So we went ahead and started our new zucchini and squash plants. So I hope you do go ahead and start your own second batch. As I always like to tell you guys, remember, there's beauty in everyone's garden. And bye-bye for now.